Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, y'all. Welcome to the Mental House Christmas Edition with me, your host, Khadija. You know, I'm feeling really, really kind of uh, discombobulated by some stuff. And I want y'all to start paying attention if you ain't already. Um, okay, this particular story, which is really, really diabolical, the Mormon church now owns two billion of U.S. farmland, and that's more acreage than Bill Gates and China combined um, in Nebraska. The Utah-based religion has been accused of driving out local farmers after it snapped up more land in Nebraska than anyone else in the past five years. It's already believed to be the biggest landowner in Florida and now owns at least 859,000 acres of farmland across the U.S., according to one estimate. The Mormons. Because the indigenous people of this country have been swindled out of their property, and it's been a land grab ever since. It comes amid growing scrutiny over church finances with some members um, unhappy with the way it's managing its fortune, believed to be up to $236 billion. And y'all think religions and religious uh, uh, Zionists and all these people ain't putting their toehold down for a reason? Because I can assure you, I can assure you that's what's going on. $2 billion of U.S. farmland? To bring them young and all these to the to the damn Mormons. Mm, mm, mm. But the, the church has provoked the ire of the Nebraska Farmers Union, whose president John Hassan um, said that this land grab was driving up prices and forcing out local farmers. It's not fair competition when folks bring in that much outside money and bid against the local farmers and the ranchers. What y'all think? What y'all think? Uh, I don't know. I'm not comfortable with that at all. And let me say before I... Uh, 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 shut the video down. Nick Carter's sister, Bobby Jean, is dead at 41. A year after her brother Aaron, a uh, tragic death. And she's the one that was doing all that talking. I just found that coincidental. You know? And also a rest RIP to, um, uh, um, who had, the, uh, uh, let's see, um, the, uh, what was it, Lori Lynn? She was part of the Dixie Chicks. R.I.P. She was in the head-on collision. And, um. You know, my condolences to her family a few days before their holiday. Their mother, their sister, mm, their family member, you know, passed away. So I want to send my condolences to them all. Wow. Wow. been busy anyway y'all tell me what y'all think about these people owning this religious group 
having all the damn land damn near in Nebraska. Let me know what you let me know. Let me know. I, I look forward to hearing from you. If you like what you hear, subscribe, share the channel. I'll see you in the next video.